Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. This channel, Every Day Science, is all about trying to learn various concepts of data science while practicing a lot of questions. In this video, we are going to solve this question on lead code regarding calculate compressed mean. The difficulty level of this question is easy, and I'm going to share the SQL schema as well as the Panda schema in the description box below. Okay. The question reads: We are given a table called orders with three with three different columns: order ID, item count, and order occurrences. Order ID is the column of unique values for this table. This table contains order ID, item count, and order occurrences. We are asked to write a solution to calculate the average number of items. Per order rounded to two decimal places, order of result does not matter. So basically, what we need to do is we have various orders, different item counts, and the order occurrences. So we need the total. Total items divided by the total order. So how can you get the total items? So item count multiplied by the order occurrences, and you sum the entire thing and divided by the sum of the order occurrences. That is going to give you the average number of items per order, right? And that is what you have. So to solve this question, what we can do is from this table called orders. So from orders, what we need is we need the numerator. Numerator is basically multiply the item count and the order occurrences. So order occurrences and then you sum this so that is going to give you the total items and then you divide this by sum of order occurrences and we need to also round this to two decimal places so if i go ahead and round to two decimal places and we need to alias this as average items per order so average items per order okay let me go ahead and run this let's see what do we get in our output so this is accepted and this is how we do it, right? Our output is same as expected output. Let me go ahead and submit this pass all the test cases. So yeah, this is accepted and this is how we do it. So not a difficult question. What we basically had to do was we had to get the total items. We basically did item count multiplied by the order occurrences to get the numerator and we divided the sum of order occurrences to get the denominator, rounded to two decimal places and alias this, whatever was needed in our output. So yeah, this is how we do it. Let me know if there's a better, more efficient solution to solve this question. Let the solution be in the comment section below and I'll see you guys in the next video.